I knew something bad was going to happen. I risked my life. I put my family in danger. If I was caught, they would have put a bullet in my head. But it was the right thing to do. It was the only thing to do. Terror plot foiled in Garden City, Kansas. Three men were plotting to bomb an apartment complex. You will not replace us! The suspects plan to level the buildings and shoot any survivors. My heart just dropped. The hate and fear that's been consuming America. They wanted to inflict as much damage to human bodies as they could. Young, old, babies, grandmothers. They didn't care. I'm Dan Day, and I'm 53 years old. Dan Day isn't the typical informant. I said, really? That guy? Really? He was like, yeah, I think he might be able to provide us some information. The FBI has you wear a wire. Right. Dan is riding shotgun, so to speak. Then comes the big surprise. The cockroaches in this country have got to go, period. I'll blow every building up right there. Boom. That, to me, was nothing less than shock. This is deadly serious now. That would have been one of the most deadly acts of domestic terrorism ever in the United States. It would have been Oklahoma City. He put his family, himself, in jeopardy for us. That was one of those moments that I realized something could happen to him. What does that tell you about heroism? I think it tells you that sometimes it comes from places that you don't expect it and from people that you wouldn't necessarily expect it from. Maybe it's not about who they are, but what they are. Oh, home, home on the range, where the sky